Happy Monday, you guys. Welcome to Holly Scoops Just Saying. I'm Madison Hill. And I'm Courtney Revolution. And it's a good Monday because we are talking about none other than Justin Bieber. And what the heck is going on in his love life? Because basically, we've realized that the guy keeps recycling his exes. Lord. And he cannot keep anyone who he hasn't dated before, essentially. Why is that? I don't know. We're going to break it down <laughs> because I'm very, very confused. As you guys know, over the weekend, Justin Bieber and Haley Baldwin were seen seriously, heavily making out in New York over the weekend at mm -hmm. several parks. Might I add, I'm not really sure why they felt like the park scene was <laughs> the place to break out the PDA, but you know, that's what they were doing, and it was a bit much. Those lips were locked. Like, it was just like, I, if I saw that on the street, I'd be like, I know they're famous, but I'm uncomfortable. That's a lot. My a lot thing, happening. For me personally, my thing was this. It wasn't even like a cute romantic peg. I mean, they were like on a park bench. They were like up against this railing. They yeah. were really giving us a steamy like, 90s teen horror movie <laughs> kiss. Like, we get it. Yes. We're back together. Exactly. Thank you. Message received. So, it, why we're bringing this up again? Because, as you guys know, Haley Baldwin and Justin kind of had a little fling in the past. It was basically the same thing. They showed a ton of PDA on Instagram, broke up, it was done. Um, that was, and now they're kind of obviously getting back together. Someone else he's done this with, obviously, Selena Gomez. They mm -hmm. were like each other's first love. They broke up, recently got back together, and now it basically looks like Justin left Selena for Haley. But I, why do you think he can never be serious with anyone that he hasn't dated before? And I don't know what these hands are. <laughs> Girl, I that's really needed you, these to that's get you that message out. trying to figure it out because Justin is throwing this mystery he at is. us, and now we got to turn into the Scooby exactly. Gang to figure it out. Exactly. For me personally, I'm thinking that this is probably a comfort issue. Okay. You know, Selena Gomez. You know, that's his. You know, his lover. Mm -hmm. I feel like. You know, when you go back to someone, you sort of set this foundation. Right. And you know, if it crumbles, you can always go back and rebuild. And I'm thinking that maybe Justin is feeling like with these women in his past, he needs either that closure, mm -hmm. or maybe he just wants to give it a second try. But I'm just like, some part of me, although I'm a Jelena shipper, I'm like, if it didn't work out the first time, like, what are the, he, he hasn't really had a serious relationship to learn from his past yes. mistakes. That's the difference. Like, I feel like Miley and Liam, like, you know, they took their time apart. They didn't really have an, too many other relationships, but they took time apart. Justin just like is just like still living his life. Like he's not doing anything to learn from his mistakes. I mean, people he's blown through are Sophia Richie. Remember that little like it was what like does we're Sophia gonna Richie do. We're gonna Instagram together and then oh yeah, we're done. Uh, there's Nicola Peltz who also was linked to Anwar Hadid because you know all these twenty somethings. All, it's very they all know each other. It's very okay, it's a little click. <laughs> they know each other real they well. They clicking lips. Exactly. Okay. And Kourtney Kardashian, like he kind of like blew through these kinds, of, not these kinds. He blew through these women, but still just to come right back to girls he's already dated before. I want to present something to you. Okay. I'm gonna turn into Shane Dawson and give you a conspiracy oh, theory. I can't wait. Now we know that Selena Gomez, Selena, we know you're working on new music, mm -hmm. and it's been rumored that you know she's thinking about, you know, maybe me and Justin aren't over. Mm -hmm. Maybe this is not the Mortal Kombat finishing moment that we were waiting for. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yes. So maybe Justin caught wind of this, you know, maybe his ear is in the streets. Mm -hmm. And he said, you know what, let me snatch up this little chick, Haley, and you know, slather on this. Did I just spit on you? You did, so because sorry. you're getting so I'm getting into passionate. It. You're getting passionate. The beaver brought the spittle out, y'all. We want passion on Justin. <laughs> I'm thinking that maybe Justin and Haley in this PDA was just kind of like, maybe it's a little slap. Yeah. A little love slap. Maybe he like wants to give her some writing material because maybe. he knows, you know, Selena could maybe Selena, use it a little bit. Selena, if you need to write a hit about <laughs> Justin to sell these records, listen, this ear is open. We're for it. Okay. We're for it. And I'm I'm just waiting for Justin to recycle with Chantal Jeffries. Basically every Instagram model that you've ever seen. <laughs> uh, they dated back in 2014, broke up, kind of got back together in 2016. So once he's done with Haley, like, should we? Is he gonna go should back to her? Should we just expect it? Should we just like? We'll call look it into now? Our, we'll look into our crystal ball should and we'll we call see. It now? That's the future we can see. But you know what's funny is that no one judges Justin for like going through ladies like there's no tomorrow and then coming back to his exes. Like we're like, oh my god, everyone's like, oh great, now I'm shipping Haley and Justin. Yeah. But what's interesting, and we were talking about this earlier, mm -hmm. when. Other celebrities do this, like, um, I don't know, our favorite Taylor, Taylor Swift. Allison Swift, okay. <laughs> Everyone gives her <laughs> a hard time, and it's like she literally just, I don't even know, did, what, committed what, a crime. What's what's the big difference? Okay, so Justin Bieber, he dates all these women. He writes his music about these women. Taylor Swift, she dates these men. She writes these great 
these worship anthems. Arts, these anthems. anthems. She gives us a bop, y'all. Mm -hmm. What's the difference? Why, why y'all hating on Taylor? I don't understand why there needs to be a difference. I mean, exactly. I feel like a ton of young celebrities do this, but you're right. And even with Kendall Jenner, and I've yes. I've even been guilty of this, mainly because I feel like her little thing with Anwar was just, again, a little incestual with this whole group of 20-somethings. Mm -hmm. But, you know, it's like she's dating around, we're all like, oh, my God, Kendall's going crazy. What's happening? Oh, la, la, la. It's kind of a similar situation, but it's Justin like does it. It's like it. stop the double standard. That's true. I don't know. But it's I think it's Justin's fans. They just want to see him happy with someone but i think justin maybe you should learn and maybe go with someone new instead of recycling all these past women what so do you think if you had to choose one new girl for justin to be with oh god what do you think a new celeb a new celeb would she be older or would she be around his I age i almost think he needs someone who is around his age because his humor is kind of immature don't mm -hmm. you think i agree Oh little goofy. God. He's a little goofy. Now, I, now you've thrown me off. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, for me personally, I'm thinking of someone, I don't have a name, but okay. I'm thinking of someone around his age, a little bit more serious, someone that can handle that goofy side. I think he almost needs someone who's not in the industry. Yes. Who can like whip him into shape. So like when he does these dumb things, she can be like behind the scenes, not in public, be like, what the hell are you doing? You don't act like that. You don't look at this girl's Instagram. Yeah. You don't like this. You don't comment this. Like, just kind of like keep him in line a little bit. He needs. You know, like someone like I don't know. I guess that's kind of like I'm describing myself. <laughs> <laughs> Madison says, "Y'all, I am red tea." Justin Bieber, hit me up. No, okay. just kidding. Just kidding. I would not make out with someone like that <laughs> on a park bench in any state. <laughs> but no, absolutely Lord. not. Absolutely not. All right, you guys, we want to know your opinions on why you think Justin Bieber constantly recycles his past relationships. What is wrong with him? Does he have trust issues, commitment issues? Does he need to learn from his mistakes? <laughs> he got some issues. He's got some right. issues. All right, you guys, talk it out down there in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe, and we'll see you here next time on Holly Scoops Just Saying. Bye, Bye guys. guys.